Welcome back ladies and gentlemen to the third episode of this mini series. Thank you for all your likes and some dislikes. This video will contain just views only of that still. As you see right over there is the sea again. Or if you as you are from America the ocean. I do have some followers now in America. That is Vasto Chita or Vasto City. Taking it around and around. And over that way is the is called Punta Pena. Point Port and now I'll take you up here and we'll see the bus depot and some olive groves Down, down there, ladies and gentlemen, is the bus depot. I will take a closer bit of filming on that in a minute. We're just going to zoom in on these olive trees. As you can see, they are full, but by now they should be black, but they are still green. Take you around here. This is the same road side. Strada San Lorenzo that I talked about in the last episode. Well, thank you very much. I will be. Ladies and gentlemen, this is it. Defonzo's, the main bus company in Vasto. Or I would say the main company in Italy as well. The car park for the staff. More olive trees. You will see me up near my house. At a friend's on a friend's land. There we go, ladies and gentlemen, to the vast landscapes of Vasto. See? In a bit close, there's all these trees and well, so far away. The vast hectares of Vasto, but she's untouched still. But one day. And this house right there will be where a friend of mine will be staying. And that is the back of the bus station. More trees. Landscape again. So she was basically just showing you what we is still untouched. Which is very unusual these days anywhere in the world. Join me later. And now we are back to the mountains. That the mountains are not called the Grand Sassi, I did get that wrong in the last episode. They are the Malia. Walter well, is the Grand Sass. The Maela. That's the one. Lowering it down. This right here is some terrain of a friend which he said we could film so follow me around and I will show you the vast landscape of the house so 
is part of her house. This is four apartments. Like I said before, I will finish it with a nice picture of the front of our house. Said, as requested by my mum. Over there, which you can see better now, is Monte Dorizio. It's only a small town, like I did see in the last episode. And that. I do believe it's Capello as well. Back over here, that is a fig tree. More olive trees. And like this year, I said the green, because we have had too much sun. And I'll pan up to the sky to show you. This is October the 5th, and it's still bright like this. So. I am almost done with this video because I do not want to bore you too long with just land. But she's, she's still got her summer vegging like we did. And there is the, old, the fig tree still producing. Join me at the top. FDR, but they are that small this year. Just to show you the difference. And now to end this film and say thank you very much for watching. This is the close up view of Casa Paludi. And that guy you're talking is my dad. This will be uploaded later today when YouTube decides to allow me. And now to the back of the house. This is our terrain land. So I done for winter veg yesterday. Grapefruit tree, apple tree, peach tree at the end. And this thing right here behind me is our Victoria plum tree. And I will walk backwards to show you it all without tripping up and the last bit will be inside the house this is inside the living room And now, thank you for watching, please keep tuned in.